Good day, everybody. Welcome back to the Dirty Pat Walsh channel with me, your host, Dirty Pat Walsh. I have a very sleeping, or very relaxed Weasley on my shoulders right now. It's nice. It feels really good. But uh, I just realized my congestion isn't that bad today. So we're going to try out some of this dental scotch snuff that Hillary sent me. Thank you very much, Hillary. And uh, now, I love the packaging on these old scotch snuffs. Like, look at that. That's cool, man. That's cool. Um, this snuff of made of, is made of superior quality, made from select leaf, and preserves its flavor. Net weight, 1.15 ounce, 32 gra 32.60 grams, dry snuff, classic dental scotch snuff, warning, smokeless tobacco is addictive, and something that is way too fine for me to read. Um, <clears throat> this is made by the American Snuff Company, so you know it's going to be a good product. Memphis, Tennessee, 59% U.S. tobacco, 41% imported tobacco, sale only allowed in the United States, and on the other side it's the same thing, except they have the, the weight denoted on the side, where is, it? is that it, yeah, weight denoted on the side, rather than on the front of the can. Now this can appears to have a it has a metal bottom and a metal lid and it appears to be fiberboard, uh, from what I can, from what I can tell. I thought it was an all metal can, but uh, fiberboard is just as good, if not better. So we're gonna crack this open. This snuff string says we're gonna crack us a pinch. My cram can crack and nail, and it's just at a perfect, perfect size right now. Let's see if that worked. Yep. Okay. So. I've never had this before. This particular brand of Scotch Snuff. And it's an original, not a sweetened one. That's what the inside of the can looks like. It doesn't really tell you anything. Um, but the product is right up to the rim on this, if you can see that. It's a very light brown. Um, it's The color is a little different than it is on my camera, but it's a very light brown. Very nice color. Um, so, yeah. Time to crack out the snuff pinching knife. I've been done this for a quick minute. Now, what I expect from this is that the barbecue to be very, very prominent. Are you gonna jump, Weasley? Yep. Okay. Good thing. All right. So we take a little bump here. Mm hmm. Okay, that last hit burned, it hit me right in the eyeball. Weasley, hey, get out of my shit, get out of my shit. <sighs> wow, what a great snuff. It's, um... It's not, it's not, uh, it's not sweetened, but it, it almost might as well be, uh, 
to my taste right now. Because it is a rather sweet uh, stuff for a natural. I'm going to put the lid on this before I dump it anywhere. That's a, it's a lovely can, lovely fiberboard can. Oh, it's got to have another can. Just to get the real McCoy out of this mother. <laughs> I'm not doing huge bumps because I'm tested, you know, I've been congested a lot lately. I don't want to hurt myself again. <laughs> okay. So yeah, the, the barbecue element, by barbecue I mean uh, a lot of American scotches smell like uh, like a campfire. Um, that's the kind of the prominent the prominent uh, scent that you get off most of them. But this one is really mild. Um, it's very, it's, it's, it's very mild. Um, and it's not as sweet as the sweetened, as sweet, like the railroad mills sweet that I tried. It's not as sweet as that. But, uh, oh, it's, it's really nice. If you like American scotches, I love American scotch snuff. I love it just as much as I love any European snuff. And it has a character all on its own, you know. Um, but yeah, it's kind of it's kind of the same deal as uh, most scotches. Like it's it, you know, it smells like uh, like a hibachi cookout. You know what I mean? Uh, which makes me the reason I like that is because it makes me feel like summery in springtime, you know. Um, whoa. Wow, yeah, I could do a lot of this stuff. Uh, the nicotine is definitely there. I, uh, I've been dipping all day today, nonstop. And I didn't really need any excess nicotine, but this one's a zinger, you know. Um, but the thing with s nicotine hits and snuff is, like, you feel them and then they die down really quick, you know. And it's not an unpleasant feeling if, if that's what you like. It's, uh, oh, it's, it's just amazing. It smells so good. And there's something else to it, like, it doesn't just smell like a campfire, you know, um, like, it's kind of got, like, a raw woody scent to it, too, you know, like, when you have, like, uh, like, like, untreated pine boards or something like that, it's got, like, a real, a real crisp, fresh scent along with the 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 charry kind of coal coal kind of smell you know and i don't a lot of people dip uh scotch snuffs cuz that's the thing about them is you can you can you can dip them too as it's a dental right there um Usually, if I'm gonna if I'm gonna use snuff, dry snuff orally, um, I would never use a European product for this, but uh, or a mentholated product for this. But scotches are good, and I I take a little bit and I I sprinkle it on a, a toothbrush or I wet a toothbrush and I dip it in the can, and I kind of like just lightly rub my gums with it, and. Uh, if I, if I, you know, if I really want a quick hit, you know, um, but yeah, lots of people in, especially down south, dip, dip this stuff, um, I don't know, maybe I'll get up the gumption to do that one day, but I don't really, I don't really have the desire to pour a bunch of powder into my lip, but, uh, but yeah, scotch, dental, scotch snuff there.
this is great, you know, I haven't, I haven't ever had a scotch snuff I didn't like, you know, um, yeah, they just have this, uh, it's a world unto itself in the snuff, in the snuff world, you know, you don't find European snuffs that, that smell anything like American snuffs, you know, yeah, and this is a real good one, it's like, it's, I thought it was going to be really strong, scented, but uh, it's not. It's very mild, kind of sweet. Yeah, it's great. Dental, classic dental scotch snuff by the American Snuff Company. So, here you go. Um, big, big super shout out to Hillary Thompson for sending me this. Um, and, yeah. I guess that's that's the review. Hope you're all good and well. And uh, thanks for all the comments I got on my video earlier today. It was very nice. Thank you very much. Hope you have a wonderful day, everybody. Be well.